Namaste friends, welcome to Learn with J, Empowered by Magic Levels. This day I am here with a snowflake titled Clinton Snowflake and uh, it is worked with DC clusters and HDCs and Ecos and chains. This particular small uh, flake I worked with my 3 ply moisturized cotton yarn from Magic Needles and a 2.3 mm clover crochet hook. Okay, so I shall be demonstrating this pattern in my Arin yarn, which is Hobby Store Arin Premium Acrylic yarn from Magic Needles, and I shall be using a 5 mm clover crochet hook. Let's go into the video without any delay. Chain 7 and slip stitch to the first chain to form a ring. You may chain 3 and begin. Chain 3 is counted as the first double crochet. Otherwise, just chain 2 for the height. And this chain 2 is not counted in any DC. You are not counting it. So make 3 incomplete doubles. Sorry. One done, two, three, <coughs> and make a cluster of three double crochets. Now chain three, make another three DC cluster. So likewise, place chain three, three DC cluster seven times. I shall complete and get back. So I shall work one more time. One half, one incomplete DC, second incomplete DC, third incomplete DC, and yarn over pull through all four loops of the hook. Chain three. So the pattern repeat. Chain three, three DC cluster. So totally we need to have eight sets of three DC clusters, and I shall tell you how to finish the last leg. So complete and get back. I have completed round 1. At the end of the round, chain 1. I have already chained 1. And place a half double crochet on top of the 3DC cluster. Now, chain 1. It is not counted as any stitch. Place 3 half double crochets in the chain 3 space. 1. 2. 3, chain 5, 4 half double crochets in the next chain 3 space, So, chain 5, 4 double crochets, chain 5, 4 double crochets, 6 more times. I shall complete 6 more times and get back to you. So, I have completed placing 4 DCs in the rest of the chain 3 spaces and I have made my last chain 5. Now, make 1 half double in the first chain 3 space we work the 3 double crochet, half doubles, so not double crochet, half doubles. And slip stitch and join to the very first half double crochet. And slip stitch in between the third and the second half double. Now place three half double crochets in the chain five space. For the next round, one, two, three. Now you're going to make a pico, chain three, and slip stitch into the last half double worked. Now two half doubles. chain 3, 3 half doubles, and 
a pico and you're not slip stitching the third chain but you're slip stitching into the half double previous half double you did and three half doubles So this is how the flake will look. Three half doubles, a pico, slip stitch into the half double last work, two half doubles, chain three, three half doubles, another pico and three half doubles. Now to go over to the next set in the next petal, slip stitch between the second and the third half double of the previous row and repeat the set of stitches you worked in the chain 5 in each of the chain 5 spaces and before going over to the next chain 5 space slip stitch into the space between in between the second and the third half double okay continue and complete the snow plate snowflake so I have completed the stitch instructions to be done in, on every chain 5 space and at the end I slip stitched into the first slip stitch that we did and then fasten off. So here we complete this particular snowflake which, is, which was titled Clinton Snowflake. Hope you like this small effort of ours. If you haven't yet subscribed to our channel please do so like and share our videos and even if you happen to be the first time you are please do subscribe to our channel like and share our videos do not forget to click on the bell icon so that you are notified of the videos that we upload every other day i shall be back with yet another pattern in the next video bye for now have a great day